magic working, pal. Ah, Tex, is there a doctor in the house? A fairy dog brother's work is never done. I'm not a doctor, but I know one on TV. But bring this mouse to my office, lickety-split. Okay, what seems to be the problem? He doesn't want to be a mouse no more. Oh, really? One of those mice. Have you learned your lesson? <laughs> oh, in that case... With my invention, I can effortlessly turn you into whatever you want. As long as it's a totally awesome four-legged shark, a somewhat useful duck-bill gerbil, or a lowly good-for-nothing house cat. Remember, Mouse, magic ain't gonna do it. This ain't magic. It's science. A mouse wanting to be a cat? You disgust me. But thank you for donating your body to science. We appreciate your trust, especially since we've never done this before. Fresh from business affairs, it's all pretty standard. Just sign there. Thank you. Ahem. <laughs> Kitty boy, ever hear of a doorknob? So he has. Run for your life! Someone should have listened to that fairy dog, brother, huh? Enough with the begging. I can't help you learn the lesson. Only you can. You just need some help from an expert. What are you doing? This detective's gonna help you find the courage to face the cat. Who is this fairy dog kidding? This little gray cheese eater couldn't find courage if it was on the tip of his nose. Easy, boy. The narrator guy comes with the mouse. Deal with it. Sure, the cat was big and the odds were long, but this little mouse had what it takes to topple the mutant cat. Or not. Want even more Boomerang? Click on one of the videos and don't forget to like, share and subscribe.